have two cousins that was murdered in Prince George's County. After losing two family members to gun violence, Sade Wright founded the Wright Family Foundation to help others impacted by crime. But on Sunday, a shooting once again hit close to home. She loved her boys. Her life was surrounded around her boys and her family. 38-year-old Tiffany Wiggins lost her life after being shot and killed along Minnesota Ave and Benning. Wright described Wiggins as a mother to two children and also a grandmother who volunteered as a violence interrupter in her spare time after Wright says she lost her own brother to gun violence 11 years ago. She was against gun violence because she know how it felt. Wiggins' death came as D.C. has seen over 50 homicides so far this year and as violent crime has spiked 28% compared to 2021. Just last week, I interviewed Wright about the homicide of 15-year-old Malachi Jackson in D.C. about what must be done to reduce crime. On Monday, she put the focus on parents. I think we have to start taking accountability. If your children is out here doing it, then you have to take accountability when your child do something. Now, as police search for whoever committed the crime, Wright says Wiggins' family now once again experiences the impact of violence. To see her be against gun violence and then get gunned down, that's just so unfair. Tom Dempsey, WUSA 9.